Most extinct animals have left behind some lingering relatives, some sort of tie to the modern world. But this is not the case for the ammonite. Having fully died off millions of years ago in the mass extinction that killed the dinosaurs, and being one of the only animals alive at the time to have its entire genus destroyed, the ammonite lives on today only in fossils, and the distant but still vaguely related nautilus. Because of this, most knowledge of the ammonites only surfaced recently, and a variety of misconceptions about the fossils and the animal they belonged to exist. At certain points throughout human history, the ammonite was believed to have been a nautilus, an odd rock formation, and even a fossilized snake with the head removed. Of course, none of these are true, and it is now known that the ammonite was, function-wise, much closer to a nautilus than any snake. The ammonite was a small, squid-like animal which used a variety of shells throughout its life for both defense and buoyancy. It would use its many tentacles to ensnare and consume prey, and would replace its shell somewhat often. Because of the nature of the actual ammonite, very few fossils of the body itself exist, but from what is known, the general structure of the animal has been gathered. The ammonite, however similar it may seem to the animals of today, is fully extinct and won't return anytime soon, no matter how common the fossil or well-known the animal is today.